Hey, what's up, guys? All right. Let me kind of explain this video before. I know you saw the title. And no, I don't believe he is a fraud or a scam or whatever. Chase, okay. I feel like I want to make a video about his last video and certain things he said. Just to kind of let everybody know who, how he really is. I know a lot of people say a lot of things about him because obviously he made a video about it. And some of the people are saying that maybe he's fake or he doesn't listen to his subscribers. He doesn't care about his subscribers or people who watch him. Uh, he changed his little, he changed the format of his Patreon. And being a YouTube content creator myself, now I'm not no, I'm not near his level, okay? I'm not even close to his level. But, and I'm not making this video to like get subscribers and get all that crap. No, I'm not doing that because I'm just not that type of person. I'm gonna keep it real with you. The reason why I'm making this video is because I want people to see and understand how he really is. And I have known him for about three years now. I've met him many times. And a lot of times he doesn't show the other side behind the camera and the things he talks about and how he really is. And if he did make a video about that, y'all would probably say, oh, he's just making this up because he just wants people to like him or he's just pretending to be caring about people, subscribers and all that. Let me tell you this, okay? I'm gonna be completely honest. Yes, at first I kind of was doubting him a little bit when I first started doing YouTube and I never met him. I thought maybe he was one of those type of people that he's just pushing products on you and trying to sell you stuff and blah, 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 like a lot of these big time people are. But I'm a type of person that I'm going to try to meet somebody and try to, you know, really see him for who he is and just see him. Now, again, he might be an asshole behind the scenes, you know, at home or something like that. I don't know. But for what I've seen of him, for what the times I've spent with him, I really feel like he's truly genuine with his videos, um, who he is as a person. What, Watching him from a distance from YouTube and also watching him from a distance at his meetups, people think, say, one of the things that really kind of upset me, uh, upset it, one, some, one thing that really upset me is that someone, I guess, told him that he doesn't care about his subscribers and stuff like that. Let me tell you this, okay? I've seen this man three or four times. I've been around him. I've hung out with him for hours. And I'm going to tell you this, he does care about his subscribers. People will come up to him and his, he signs helmets, phone cases. I remember one year at his meetup, I was I was just sitting here, you know, I don't know, I was just talking, whatever, walking around, and this kid was just sitting here. He was just he was just standing, and he was just staring at Chase while Chase was talking. And I walk up to him and say, "Hey, man, you know, blah blah blah." I say, "I said, what's wrong?" He said, I, "You know, he just watched." I said, "Why don't you just go up there and talk to him?" And he was like, "I'm nervous," and this, that, and the other. And I literally took him by his hand and walked him over to Chase and had him and, and had Chase talk to him. Chase wasn't like walking around being, uh, you know, mean or or not caring and stuff like that. And I really believe a lot of his videos or most of his videos are about the ride and about motorcycles and trying to help you make good decisions whenever you decide to buy a bike. I mean, if you think about it, what he's doing is really helping you. And yes, I can understand some people could think he, because he's so, he has all these subscribers and he has his Patreon and he does this, he does that. You know, a lot of times those people are haters. And the way he handled it, I found very classy. Now, again, this is somebody who is not a part of his affiliation. I'm, I'm not part of his team. I'm not part of his anything. I'm just a content creator just like him. I'm not even in the... He has million subscribers. I only have like a thousand. So I don't really like... It's not like he's paying me to make this video. But I feel like if somebody I feel like that I have met and I have hung out with and I feel like is being wronged or, or people are thinking he's some way, I'm going to make sure, like, tell him, hey, no, that's not how it is. And the thing is, is this is another perspective. It's not like he's making this video. Because if he had made a video about the back behind the camera stuff, people would probably say, like, oh, he's just pretending to be this. He's just pretending to be that. 
So this is something that I, he doesn't even know I'm doing. And I hope he doesn't get mad, Chase. Hope you don't get mad if you see this. But I am just want to tell you I have your back. And the people who don't believe in his message or think he's this way, that is that is your opinion and you, that you have that right. But I'm telling you from somebody who is not part of that and somebody who's outside looking in, I'm telling you this. He is not like this. So what I did was I took a bunch of clips from the day he had his, his last meetup and I just put it together. I really didn't do a lot of editing. I wasn't going to, I mean, yes, I cut out a lot of the parts that were just like boring or whatever or in between or whatever. But I try to get the good parts of that day and I'm going to show it to y'all. Like I said, it's going to be kind of a long video, but I feel like it's worth it if you really want to see who he really is. So I'm not doing this video, by the way, to get subscribers or whatever or use him as a, as a whatever, I don't know what you want to call it, because I'm not like that. I'm, I'm keeping it real. I'm not trying to be a certain way. What I'm trying to do is say, hey, Chase is my friend. I'm just making a video that people don't see, or he he hasn't even seen this video. I mean, he knew I was videoing it, but he doesn't know what I put out there. So, guys, just take a look, see how he is, and then make your decision, you know, if you think he's an asshole. If you watch this video and still think he's an asshole, then I guess, you know, that's your opinion. So, guys, with that, I hope you enjoy the video. If you like this video, I have another video of a, of a lot of the things he does as far as uh, his filming and some of his filming equipment and things like that and what he does what he does to make the quality films that you see today. I'm telling you, it's pretty epic and I love it and if this goes well, I will make that video. So in the comments below, let me know what was your favorite part of my video about him. And then give him a shout out, like, you know, support him too regardless he has a million that's crazy i'm i only have a thousand subscribers and i'm telling you to support somebody who has over a million go figure huh but anyway so with that guys i'm out watch the video tell me what y'all think about it probably made it i gotta talk to the real star what's going on what's going on what's up over yo How you doing? Hey, how you doing, Cowie? Good. I'm all right. Hot. A little bit. Not too bad. Right. Yeah. Hi. What? What? <laughs> what? I see you all the time. I see you all the time. I'm so upset with your husband. He's supposed to. He's supposed to go ride. Last time I came down. Like check me out. And I get it, I get it. I'm a small channel. He probably has a thousand people ask him. No, ride. it's not even that. It's like, it's like, it's very rare that he's going to ride. Like, what kind of one? I don't know. There's not a rock band in the body. I will beg to differ after what I just heard. Are you kidding me? DC. DC. AC's already current. Grabs all the DC's are mobile devices. <laughs> Alright. You guys can run it from here. Oh, that. Like, oh, yeah. Okay, what do I do? Well, I, he knows he's got to take it apart. He's like, I'm not going to worry about this now. I'm just going to start taking it apart. He pulled hardware out of every fucking part on that mic and got nothing off of it. <laughs> there was just shit hanging everywhere with no hardware. And I'm like, what the fuck happened? Those are good times. But I remember he said, remember he said he was going to put J.B. Weld on it? They did. They did. I know he did, but he was like, I was just kidding, guys. I was just kidding, guys. That's what happens when you let a kid play in a garage. You know what I'm saying? So, um, my fault. Chase calls me up. He's like, listen, he's like, I got this EX thing, and he's, uh, I'm in over my head. He's like, I need some help. So I'm like, all right, let me come over and check everything out and see what you're Little does Brian know. So at that point, I'm like, all right, so I shot over to Chase's place. I walk in. He's like, here's the bike. I'm like, there's a hole in the frame. Yeah, I see that. He's like, well, he's like, well you're, you're going to have to replace it. You're going to have to replace the frame. There's no way to fix it. He's like, all right, well, can you do that? And I'm like, of course I can. You know? He's like, um, you're the fucking neighbors. So you'll be here next week? 
<laughs> you know, I was like, well, let's see what else is going on. <laughs> so I start going, start going through everything. Calipers are hanging off. Uh, most of the body work is off of it. The front upper is cut in half for some reason. You got happy with this drill. There's just <laughs> rear sets hanging off on both sides and just stuff hanging everywhere. And I'm looking at it, I'm like, <laughs> looking at the, at the lift and I'm like, what the fuck did you do? Where's all the hardware? Yeah. And he's like, I was right here. Yeah. A bowl. <laughs> like, there okay. was probably 150 nothing bolts <laughs> Just piled. At least it was in one centralized place. Yeah. I'd rather them been scattered all over the lift close to where they came out of. <laughs> one of my friends and customers uh, died in a wreck That's after I went up the place. He just happened to be the one guy at the mountain and uh, I've for a long time. That got the job to work on the and he was doing good work. I would like to the show, then I need to work on the bike. Now he's fucked up. Yeah, he worked on the bike. I'm confident that it wasn't the final And so was everybody else. So he's just the one that was like, yeah. And that being said, um, from a technician standpoint, it's better, but yeah. like, these guys you know, are no like, like, Every time I put a bike on my lip, but if I take anything off of it, I have now put that person's life in my hands. Yeah. Yeah. So what if somebody put a, a booster on a turbo nitrous and then so dies yeah. from using it? Now, Does that count? I installed a uh, turbo so kit so on that guy's bike. And I yeah, did something wrong. Time, well, I'm yeah. Hooked up an oil line backwards, and the turbo blew up. Oh sprayed everything with oil. He crashed and died. That's my fault. Right, right. Yeah, okay. So, my perspective on the whole thing is to make sure that that shit's not going to happen. You know, so, you need to be very conscientious about where it comes off, where it goes back on, how tight it goes back on. So, that whole thing, I was super excited about that. Because I saw the video, and if it's not done right, you run that risk. Said that. That's what I was saying. <laughs> he was already angry, so there were no time for jokes. <laughs> I said I wanted to be close to Chase, but I didn't think I want to be this close. Yeah. <laughs> this is motor vlog ass right here. This, <laughs> vlog ass. this is America's motor vlog ass. Oh, wait, seriously yep, I told you. <laughs> Not acceptable. Bring on the rain now. Maybe. Okay. Now we're ready for that. Well, just the guy fucking makes already dry. <laughs> Okay, so I got a white shirt on. I have to be dry, or else this becomes a different type of shit. <laughs> yeah. Demonetize. Demonetize. We'll Patreon for that life. too. No, no, right? <laughs> oh, all right, so Patreon. Why are we not members on Patreon, guys? 
Oh, I have my, I have my giant umbrella in my car, but my windows are down. Yeah. $1. Yeah, but it's like, you know, you're going to win the lottery. Yeah, but now they're talking about doing Gromps, and I'm not going to lie. If That's the guy three wins, winners! If a guy wins a Panigale of the episode before and the guy win a Grom, I'm going to be like... <laughs> it's still a free motorcycle. I mean... <laughs> you got three times the chance. Three times the chance. Yeah, if anything. And plus, who, yeah. how awesome would it be to get a lower jack? It would be great. Yeah. Like a dragged out Grom? Nah, dude. Or a, a straight up street race. Which I had two. L lift it up, put some knobbies on it. Put some yeah. yeah. Pulp Supermoto Grom. 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 Pulp Supermoto Right. Yeah. Uh, I, an extended tank yeah. and a fucking rack and a fucking high, the high fairing what window. The window. <laughs> see, I think, see, before, I think you need Brian here to kind of, yeah. you know, loop in. He's, the, he's our feasibility man. Yeah, you know, he, yeah, he's, 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 you know, he, he's the one to put you but in like, check. Like, right. no. Brian knows it's doing Brian would well. do it. Yeah, put a fucking I'm not speaking for him. I mean, if I'm about to say, let me ask him that. I was like, no, you're not. Yeah. So question Chase, I made a, a series when I when I transformed my wife's bike and I said wife wreck rebuild. Can I use that? Can I use that? I mean I haven't trademarked wreck like Well I know, but you know you don't want stuff on someone's toes. <laughs> yeah, you, wanna, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Of course you can use that. You yeah. know, I don't I you know I, I don't wanna go and, I you know, look I don't wanna go bleach myself and then put some glasses, put a hat, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> Say I'm Chase. <laughs> I, got a spring, so I, that action. I got it. I got the first episode right. I roll in the mountain, bring everybody along with. We pull all three groms out, and I trip, hit one grom, one grom hits the other grom, other grom hits the other grom. <laughs> now they're wrecked. Yep. Yeah. All right. Now see awesome. where you can do it is that door that like is the mystery door. Just open that up, and, and then you have the groms out. Yeah. Yes. Oh my god. Or or you can do. Can I you could do like you could have you could do like three groms and basically like you do one brian does the other one and someone does the third and then like you just kind of like do them all at the same time that's so me and we we've talked about i think it was on build stream maybe where we were talking about having a season where it was a build off but like we'd have to we'd, we'd have to have like a both have a set budget though yeah. And we can only use so much money to get the bike and, and, and fix it. Yeah, because me and Brian were giving shit to each other like, mine will look good, mm -hmm. yours will run good. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Do what my wife did. We... is just an open gate sandwich, and sandwiches are the best food ever created. Also, well, I found see. out that what well, place has a really good cauliflower pizza? Blaze. Blaze? That fucking pizza. That whole pizza. Sorry, did you say cauliflower pizza? Yeah. yeah. Sir, cauliflower I did. Like cauliflower yeah. Yeah. Sir, I would like to tell you right now. Oh, gosh, no. <laughs> I would like to tell you right now. Sure, blasphemy. No, blasphemy. No, the same. Don't listen pizza to is supposed to be bready and no, horrible beforehand. Yeah. When you eat it, it should dribble nasty grease, grease down your cheeks. Oh, wait. What video was that? Was that the Duke, the Super Duke? That I'm just in the background eating a folded over giant piece of pizza. Question. Question. He's got on a flat bill hat backwards and jeans that hug his calves. Hey, you gotta show them bitches off. You gotta show them bitches off. Have you seen yeah. these motherfuckers' calves? Yeah. What the that boy has the sexiest calves in this entire look, look. room. What the hideaway See, socks? You put them on this. What the hideaway socks? I showed up socks. these wearing shorts. I was like, I what the fuck are these? Yeah, I'm like, here we go. Well, the man, pull them up. He's got the hideaway socks, too. And the hideaway socks. He's just got a long-ass boot. That boy's got some calves on. Let's talk his pants. He's, 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 wor he's working on the rest of it, but you already got the calves on point. Look, I mean, if you just tapped in America, that is America's ass. Yeah. <laughs> His calves look like he's about to do two of the fronts. Like, wow. They're all vascular and oh, like that it's commercial. The guy's like, I, I got my insurance company, my calves. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> my calves are custom. <laughs> First day he came out in shorts, I was like, who the fuck's legs are those? Do they know you stole just their calves? I know. <laughs> so it doesn't get caught in the chain. Leave them alone. The pants wouldn't be so bad. The calves weren't as big as that. That's fine. That's fine. I've been to Pakistan and over there, no one gives a shit about traffic lights. So it'll be, it'll Don't be they have like weird honking? Yes, like, yeah, yeah. Everyone just on. If we have yeah. like different honks, that means like go ahead, yeah, yeah, stop, yeah. let me in. And then most of them are just like jackasses and they just go. I'm like, dude, do you not see it as a red light? Like, like, fuck that. Exactly. Fuck that red light. Red light. Okay, no red light. Fuck the system. Red light's in a bad spot. Yeah. Well, it's like, I don't know if you know him on Instagram, Yemenite. 
So he oh, like follows every motovlogger ever, and he's like really active in it. But he rides in Yemen, and they like they he shows videos and stuff of like all the trapping and shit in there, and it's just and of fucking monium. And they're not allowed to have over a certain displacement of uh, motor vehicles over there, so they can only have like a four three hundred or four hundred up to. Yeah. Right. So everybody is riding on like one fifties and one twenty fives over there. Right. So it's just a bunch of buzzy, loud, screaming fucking scooters just <laughs> everywhere you go, <laughs> and they don't give a fuck. And then you see things like full families on fucking one like one fifty cc oh, yeah. scooter. You got like a mom and her baby on a backpack. You got like dogs on the fucking floorboard. The whole family was like on one scooter. There was like mom, baby, dad, and then their luggage like all over the place. And I'm like, holy fuck. Uh, that is a good point. That's I see Chase in there telling Brian, nothing you can say can, can harm me. And then Brian's like, challenge accepted. Yeah, right. <laughs> no. Next thing, next Rex Wright re you see Chase. Oh God! I would. Yeah. This stuff is so thick. I would. No I would You're love to see just an entire episode of him roasting both you and Luke. I could probably make. I have enough we content to make an episode out of it. Do it! 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 Do me. <laughs> <laughs> wow! You have to be one of the people because if you're, she opens it up, she knows. Yeah, yeah. she knows. Yeah. Yeah. Watch the roast. The host has the host. <laughs> the host has the more has the most info. <laughs> There's a lot of passionate people. I love my roast. Considering I'm the one that basically roasted Brian for two years straight. Right. Yeah. We'll have Brian on there. We'll have to get a panel like four. I'm sure I won't have a problem with finding four people to roast the shit out of me. No, you just need to do a full I'd be happy to make that sacrifice for you. Motor <laughs> 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 so yeah, I, I, I probably have a line of waiting. <laughs> of what? Of people waiting, waiting to, to get in on that. Sucks, I hate it! I'm gonna exactly. Like, like, uh, <laughs> having a stroke? Yeah, probably. <laughs> he lives in that yeah, state. Yeah, I know. It's <laughs> on the borderline. Is it locked? No. Oh, okay. Yes. A pool heart. No. <laughs> yes. He said pull hard, he's like, yes. <laughs> I'm gonna break. Yeah, because I, Chris is, I keep, I, I don't want to rip the handle off as it across the problem. See, I got to keep no. thinking, Chase, when I see your channel, I'm like, man, you got me. So I went, I was like, man, you've been doing this like eight years. I got to keep remembering, you've done it for so long. Dude, if you, I got uh, to grow. If you want to have a, like a, came out of nowhere story, it's not on my fucking channel. Hey, do you still have a hard drive that, uh, has any of the video game videos on it? Video game videos? Yeah, when you were doing your video game channel? Oh, fuck no. Oh, I can't sure. find any of that content. Dude. No. Oh, like, Go back on hands YouTube. Hands down, the worst video, video game, game YouTube channel ever. I, but I, I, I don't even remember <laughs> what it was called. It was I, uh, C2 Dub Games. Yeah. yeah. Oh, wait, that. No, so, the one before that, I don't know the name of either. Okay, that so the bad. first channel I ever had on YouTube, <laughs> I used to make video game yeah. videos. Yeah, I can't find riding, that channel. Then you started riding the 50cc scooter with your buddy from college. Yeah, well. And then it just went downhill. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it went downhill to a million. Yeah, yeah it went downhill to a million. <laughs> Chase hit the floor and like, you know what, let's dig a hole and go deeper. Yeah, yeah. now, now I'm, I'm a million I'm subscribers. Yeah. I'm at a million I'm subscribers. I'm really up. down. I remember 100,000. Yeah, we were talking about that the other day. I was. Dude, how long did take like you? How long did it take you get to like ten thousand? Oh, um, no, you got to understand. Like, I was, that was a different era yeah, where like a thousand was, was like you were a dude. big fucking yeah. deal. Yeah. Okay. And then like eventually it got to the point where like somebody <laughs> hit ten thousand. Like, oh shit, y'all, we about to get all famous. <laughs> so like, it was a, it was a different game. So like a thousand was probably like the hundred thousand uh, nowadays. I know. Yeah. So, so I'm working on the it. Lake Lanier ride where you met Bo. I mm -hmm. think it was the first meetup with Matt and. Yeah. Uh, Downing? We met at like the, shift there? No, but the, well, the first one, I don't think we Ooh. met at uh, the Mall of Georgia. Yeah, it was like four of us yeah. or some shit. I don't know who all was there. And then, yeah, Bo's it was Bo's first time riding a motorcycle, and the next week he went with. 
Downey and Rami that all into know. the dragon. So that was like year, <laughs> I think that was a year two or something like that, where yeah. it was like, I don't really, the first one wasn't really a meetup. It was just like, hey, let's get a couple people together. Hey, but you know, here's the good news, guys. I'll tell you Chase's secret. What you got to do is borrow a Panigale, shit wreck that bitch, and you'll be famous. True story, it's in the top five videos on the channel. you got to make like three videos, and two two out of the three are going to block the speedometer. Yeah. <laughs> Well, did you see? Real, did you see him up. pull out in front of me when I was only doing eighty? Yeah. <laughs> no, no. I, it's I, weird. I told him I would not like to work with him because I just don't believe in. I wouldn't want to use that. So like, how am I gonna promote a company? I, I felt like it would look shitty if I promoted them in a video, but then you didn't see my bikes on yeah. there. Right. Because I, I didn't want to use them. That so. that makes sense. Uh -huh. Yeah. At some I mean, point, people 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 no one's gonna want your shit because you haven't you haven't built a channel. So. If, if, I, if I did first rides and I can constantly got better at the videos, not only but that's what I'm getting at. Getting better at the videos, like you just did the same thing every time. Yeah, well, I mean, there's something to be said about if I built a channel with nothing but first rides, I, I would get massively more views than next time I did, and I could constantly make the content better, both in camera quality, what we do in the videos, and how I talk itself. I could get better. So, like, there's a <laughs> There's an argument to have a very like hyper specific channel. The reason I don't only do first rides is because like I would get bored. Yeah. So like, and I also my content is always it's all like predicated on stuff that I don't have to come up with. So like. <laughs> First rides are always, there's always new bikes, there's always new stuff to review, and like people are going to keep wrecking I do feel like there's a huge niche that is missing now where the old school motor vlogs where people rode their bikes and just talked about random topics. Like you never yeah, see that. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, uh, well, you haven't seen my channel yet. Oh, I, do, I, do, I do all the time. Yeah. Yeah. Like, the random topic is the thing because like if you think about it, like a first ride is all fancy and shit. Yeah. Like, it's literally a motor vlog on top of a bike. That's pretty much it. Fancy shit with yeah. You know what I mean? So. It's like a, it's a dressed up <laughs> motor vlog that's specific topic. It's oh, not like yeah. I get on a bike and I'm like, today I'm going to talk about the fucking cloud over there. Yeah. It looks like a damn elephant. See, but now you're a million subscribers. You can chase this. It's taking shit right there and it's at least 50,000 views. I easily. wish it was. The way I see it is it's different for everyone. Like yeah. your, your low could be someone else's high. Yeah. So it's the same thing. I mean, you know. never know what else. Exactly. Also, so the whole Walter situation with the depression stuff. Imagine somebody that watches Walter's video talking about depression, and then it's like, okay, this person that I like hypothetically, somebody looks up to Walter, and that person idolizes them, and they have depression, but they don't want to talk about it. But then they see this guy that they look up to. He's like, this dude's making a fucking YouTube video to two million people talking about depression. So then that could open that person up to being like, you know what? I should, if anything, talk to somebody else. So, like, you gotta always think about like how many people in different situations and like all these minute little changes that could benefit from that so like that's the way i see walter that makes about sense stuff because like I, i'm not currently depressed or anything like that but like i'm like that's that's pretty like that you got to open up a lot to tell people who are used to you being like whoa everything is awesome i have a funny personality to be like hey like i'm not that right now and being like up front so Whenever I've talked on a video about like, I'm just not really feeling riding right now. You know, but like see, that's doing... real. That's actually you being real, and that's what I like. Yeah, but that's Walter. That's exactly what Walter's doing. But talking about being depressed, like, you gotta have some fucking balls, dude. Because like, people, I don't know what Walter's comments look like, but like, I know my comments. If I talk about being depressed, I guarantee there'd be a comment like, "Good, go kill yourself." You know what I mean? Damn. Like, yeah. Okay. Oh, yeah. Damn. No doubt. Yeah. 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 Damn, it's hot. Oh, really? Have you been to the sun? Have you been to the sun? <laughs> I've been on it. It is really hot there. Sorry, we live in it's, South Georgia. I haven't gone to that trip yet. Yeah. Um, but you also got to be careful. People think you're, you're, people are trying to use emotions to get views, too. Yeah. I agree with that, but knowing Walter, how I do. Well, yeah, you know Walter, yeah. The last fucking person that's going to do that is to be this, like, clickbaity, like. No, he's like, clickbaity, but not about the press. No. Yeah, he, <laughs> but not about depression. I'm not saying he doesn't play the game because we yeah. all play the game to some degree. Have y'all seen the face on that fucking cooler video? My soul yeah. died. Yeah, my soul died. I cannot, like when, when I was uh, filming, I forget what video it was, but Walter was here, and uh, 
like so much of my energy has to go out making a fucking thumbnail because it's just like <laughs> right right yeah it's like that's, that's not video we need to make like behind the scenes just like just a video of him yeah, trying to get a thumbnail that. that's more yeah. that video that's yeah. why yeah. I, I, like an hour I bet long you video. a 10 minute video has about 30 minutes of just different poses yeah. trying to find the funny dude that's why i love first starts because like when i have to go to make a thumbnail for the first try, I take a very specific photo and I put text on it. I'm not anywhere in it. I don't got <laughs> shit to do with it. Makes the bike look good. Yeah, it's yeah. like, hey, just talk about the fucking bike. Like, yeah. That's all you got. Yeah. The focus of that video is the bike. Okay. Right. Yeah. Like, yeah. That's. I think that's why I gravitate to like. Obviously, I like doing all the camera stuff too. But like, I just can't stand. From thumbnail. now on, you should only have pictures of you in first rides. Yeah. <laughs> no, Let's no see how fast I can kill this million subscribers. Yeah, yeah. right. I'll I got ideas like, for days, son. Hey, Chase, I'm here for a first ride. There's a bike somewhere. But That's right. Like, well, we're not worried about that. Have it super far in the back, and I'll be yeah. in the front, like, <laughs> selfie fucking We're now status. doing a series that took us eight years to get here. How quick right. can we get back to zero? Yeah. <laughs> right. how, to, how to grow a channel, and then destroy a channel, and then go back. Yeah. channel rebuild. Right? Yeah, right channel rebuild. <laughs> Where's, he, where's, he, where's, your support, where's your where's your where's your video Heather for Chase first ride? Wow! <laughs> hey! Wow! It took a hey, Patreon! Hey, <laughs> hey, 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 I'll be Patreon too. for that one. Like, oh, yeah. <laughs> All right, so we're gonna have to travel back. <laughs> years. Just reenact it. Oh yeah. Just, just reenact it. YouTube's the wrong channel. That's already out there. Oh, no. <laughs> we'll make sure it's monetized. Yeah. That's a separate YouTube account that That's we do separate. not make. That's Pornhub <laughs> at YouTube. <laughs> I think it's about yeah. to you this time. Yeah. <laughs> I heard it say time, I'm just like, hey, This time it's going in the pocket. I'm going to hold it just so I don't slip up. Chase says you can win the next rebuilt bike if you get a tattoo <laughs> on him of his helmet. You can't do it with Chase. Do it with Chase. Do it with Chase. What, all I got to do is get a tattoo? <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding because no, no, no. he might actually do it. <laughs> He's like, hey, Cowie, did you tell some guy to get a tattoo? And uh, he said you did a bike? I was like, well, we'll do it, we'll do it together. I'm trying, I'm trying to collect the details on how I collect my motorcycle. Uh, Next on Chase Two Wheel, Cowie and Chase build a bike real quick. That's a really cool thing. Is that brand new? Yeah, I don't know. It's my brother's. Cause it's got the little icon. It's a, it's a uh, L, it's a L. It's a L, 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 and I took like my all my filming equipment shit, took the best mic we had, and we sat him on the couch and he's just eating a carrot. And all it sounds like is yeah, there so are so many super high quality. Like, I have watched this so many times just to hear the sound of carrots. Because he's like he just eats a carrot super fucking loud. But uh, yeah, we were we had the whole like cinema camera and everything. ASML motor, motorcycle edition, it's just like <laughs> chain rattle and we like. Can, <laughs> we can do an entire episode of Wreck by Rebuild ASMR and ASMR ASMR <laughs> So what's a like? What's a letdown on a video for you? You wise, like a, a letdown, like, like, like oh, I posted this, and damn it, didn't you? Nearly what I thought it was. It's, it's little bit of, yeah, I was gonna say dependent on the video because like if I do a first try and it doesn't get much more than thirty thousand, I'm like that bike wasn't that positive. Yeah, over a couple of days, not like the first. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is yeah, you gotta let it. Yeah, let it. Yeah, yeah. I don't, I don't really judge the videos to use because like. Uh, my channel oh, is not fast views. Yeah. I don't yeah. have like this, subscribers just like blowing videos. We're watching it right there. Um, but like after about two weeks, I'll, I know where a video is going to go. <laughs> now sometimes a video can like go out of it. Like so when I did the air flight video, yeah, that video did decent for the first two weeks, and then something happened like months later, and that video's got like a million views now. So it's like, fuck, how is it? Exactly. I started gave one away. You got it. Yeah, so. Um, yeah, around two weeks, if the video, if the first ride doesn't have like 30,000. And sometimes it's the bike, though. You know, like, if you do a bike that people just aren't looking up. Aren't looking up. Um, but like for a regular ish video, I would prefer it to have 20,000 views. But like, it's a, it's a crapshoot, man, because I did that. Um, 
in your in Sunday series. Yeah. So shower months Perfect. Just to make that video. Dude, I love that video. Just, I think it's too long. Like realistically, but um, yeah, you put I put months into that video and it has like 19,000. I guess you could start doing that. You could. There's no way. I mean, I could. I guess I could. And then. Yeah, I'm the same way. Like, and I got it. Like, I cut that interview down from an hour to 15. So, yeah, it, it uh, it's hard to get it down. But I feel like if I want to do those, do those, and for them to do well, they need to be like eight minutes. To yeah. not like specifically not do like I don't want to do Dan because like I could like oh the places I know I don't want to. Uh, we already know. Yeah, yeah. It's not. But I want to do Dan. I don't want her. I, I don't. Wanna you want to do, do something that's out of side your circle. No, you, guys, well, you got a circle. Outside of my circle, but I want to do like a normal guy. Because like we get like, if you, and yeah, you're probably in the same group. Like when you ride and make videos, like you kind of think of riding in a little different of a way than like the average guy who like might have a GoPro, but it's there for like, in case something happens. Right. So like I would prefer to do people like that that just are like before they're tainted by, you know, the YouTube stuff. Because like it's just... Motorcycle people are interesting. Like to ride a bike, it doesn't really make a lot of sense. It's it's more dangerous, and you're out in the elements, and you're riding in the rain sucks ass. Like to make that decision, like that's a that's a, you got to be a certain type of person. Is a weird. Yeah, there's some type of like weird thing yeah. of like you know like wow. enjoyment of a of the riding experience is like entirely different for somebody that rides. Like, even over somebody that has a a car that they've like souped up and stuff like that because like they're still inside. Right, they're not outside, out right? Yeah, but you gotta be careful yes. because you might get somebody's like, Oh my god, I'm riding with Chase, I gotta do a wheelie, but I've never done yes. a wheelie before in my life. Oh, no, I gotta, yeah. you know, you got you gotta worry well, about like, those I types. I, I don't go ride with those people. Like, I, if when we show up to film that, like, we have the Jeep, we've got the camera car set up, like, there's so there's no there's no riding with it, and like, all the riding shots are really chill. Like, we can't to fucking Jeep Compass, we can't, like, let's go to Blood Mountain and then I'll follow you. Yeah, like, I don't get that. It'll break down. So, it would break down. Yeah. <laughs>